Hey guys, Tyler here. Welcome back. I'm going to be redoing my Disney DVD collection, uh, regions two, region zones two through five. I will also be including my foreign VCDs. So let's go ahead and get started. I'll be showing you guys my foreign Disney DVD collection outside America and Canada. So let's go ahead and get started. I have a lot. I actually, um, I actually have a lot of foreign DVDs. I collect, uh, DVD imports from other countries. I get them usually through eBay and that type of stuff, so, yeah, when they're cheap. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. First one. Sorry, I'm trying to get the load. Here's the back. This is actually uh, imported from the country Singapore, which is in Asia. Region Zone 3, NTSC. Here's the disc. Imported from Singapore. We got the Australian DVD of Bedtime Stories. Disc right there. Region Zone 4. Just so you guys know, some of the some of the discs uh, on a few of these are missing because they're actually in here. We'll get to those at the end. This is the Italian DVD. Christmas Carol with Jim Carrey. This DVD is imported from Norway. This is my only Norwegian DVD I have. Tron Legacy. As an advertisement for Tron Legacy in 3D, which came out the 17th of December of 2010 or 2011. Whichever year it came out. I forgot which year it was. Probably, I think it's probably like 20, yeah, yeah, it's either 2010 or 2011, probably. Here's the disc, Region Zone 2. Most of these foreign DVDs are Region Zone 2. Mars Needs Moms, the UK edition. The film sucked, but I'll keep it for the collection purposes. My copies of this movie. Disney DVD logo on the back right there. Nightmare for Christmas. This is a German import. Of the Disney version. We got the Russian Federation DVD of Brave, imported from Russia. Region Zone 5. Region Zone 5. Here's another Russian Disney DVD. Little Mermaid 3 Ariel's Beginning. Spoiler, but more Disney DVDs are on the way. I ordered some more Disney DVDs from overseas. Those will be coming in pretty quick. Hopefully. If you guys are curious, it, it took like two weeks to get here. Like around 16 days for me to get my first package from Russia. It took about 16 days to get to Colorado. Through the mail. If you guys are curious. 
Took like two weeks. Peter Pan. This is the 14th Disney animated feature, according to the spine. That one's imported from the UK. Here's the Japanese DVD of Ratatouille, which I got through uh, Amazon a while back. Region 2 NTSC. Cars. This is imported from France. This is the French copy. Here's the disc. G-Force. This is the Australian edition. Here's the disc. Bolt. This is the Italian DVD. Yeah, this is imported from Italy as well, just like that time stories. Beauty and the Beast, this is the Platinum Edition version, imported from France. THX Optimizer. It also has a DVD guide in there. Yeah, this is actually a French copy, imported from France. This next DVD actually was made in Belgium, according to the back. This is this DVD, this Disney DVD was made in Belgium. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, I believe this is the Diamond Edition. Imported from the country Belgium. I think they replaced the case. It says made in Mexico, but I know that's not true. find that kind of weird. Somebody replaced the case to it. Probably because the other case was in bad shape. Film. And the bonus features. This one's imported from Singapore as well. Just like the first one I showed. Tim Burton's Frankenweenie. Disc. I like the slipcover in that one. <clears throat> Has like a meta finish on it. It's kind of cool. Here's the Australian DVD of Finding Nemo. There are 32 uh, chapters total in the, in the film. Wreck-It Ralph, imported from the UK. According to this, this is the 51st Disney animated feature. Beauty and the Beast. White disc on this one. This is the Diamond Edition, I'm pretty sure. 24th Disney Animated Classic. Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion Witch and the Wardrobe. 
imported from the UK. This is in widescreen. Pirates of the Caribbean Dead Man's Chest, Australian DVD. This one obviously has the movie. Sky High, this is the Australian edition. Waltz Entertainment is mentioned on the back of this one. Here is the disc. This is the UK DVD foreign, I mean the British DVD of Race Horse Mountain Foam Rental from YMCA. Here is the disc. Enchanted. This is the Turkish DVD. That's like a Turkish hologram. I don't know how well you'll be able to see that. Oh, now you can see it. And they recycled the UK artwork on the disc, which I noticed. It's pretty weird. It even has the English title on it. Turkish DVD of A Christmas Carol. It says the exact same thing, pretty much. Also from Turkey. Ripped off the UK artwork again. Also has an advertisement for 3D Blu-ray in there. I do have a couple foreign 3D Blu-rays as well. We got Bambi 2. This is the UK edition. Singaporean DVD of Tomorrowland. Form rental from Easy DVD. Hang on. There. See? And there's the Singapore Board of Film Censors certificate. Here's the disc. The Australian DVD of Wally. -E. I accidentally stepped on this DVD once, and that's how that happened. By mistake. It was definitely not intentional. There is the disc. 32 chapters in this one as well. Same amount as Finding Nemo. Princess and the Frog. This is imported from France. This is the... It says the 98th uh, animated feature. I honestly don't believe that. I don't. I don't think. I don't think it's that high. <laughs> Here's the disc. It also came with this. I'm not really gonna show that one. I've already showed it in the past, I'm pretty sure. This next one is the only Brazilian Portuguese Disney DVD I have. I might try to get a couple more if I can, like maybe Wally. I'll try to get my hands on Wally from Brazil if I can. Tangled. Brazilian Portuguese. Has artwork on the disc, which is rather cool. Region 4 NTSC. Australian DVD Mars Needs Moms. Again, the film sucks, but I got it. Ugh. Excuse me. I got it for the collection purposes. Here's the disc. Wally UK DVD. The disc is in here. The Incredibles 2.
UK DVD. It has a white disc. Robin Hood. This is the um, 2006 edition imported from Spain. This is in Spanish. Imported from France. This is Wally. Disc. Australian DVD of Rage to Witch Mountain. Disc. German DVD of Cars. Here's the Australian DVD of Cars. And there are, yet again, 32 chapters. Toy Story 10th Anniversary Edition. This is the UK edition. It's one in disc two. Here's Toy Story 2. This is also the special edition. Incredibles. This is the Turkish edition. <clears throat> that's what the Turkish hologram looks like. Yeah, that's what the Turkish hologram looks like. Pretty nice. Yep, there's the Turkish hologram. You guys can actually see how it looks now. That's what it looks like in Turkey. Region Zone 2. Disc. Turkey's in the Middle East, obviously. That one is a part of the Middle East. Here is The Incredibles. Nice slipcover from the creators of Finding Nemo. Here is the back. This one and this two. This is the UK version. Even though it's quite obvious. Race to Witch Mountain, imported from Singapore as well, Region 3 and TSC. Here is the disc. Winnie the Pooh, this is the UK version, 2011. It's my only copy of this movie. Kitties are in the living room. My mom's hanging out with the cats. Here, are the, here's the disc. Finding Nemo. This is the German version. THX certified. This one. Disc two. There. 
Also got the Turkish disc, but unfortunately, guys, I noticed on disc one, there's like three freaking cases. I mean, three freaking, not cases, three freaking cracks in the center of the disc. You know, it still works. I'll try to show you. I don't know how well you could see that. Look. There's one. There's two. Oh my god. I think there's actually more than three cracks. Look at that. There's like two freaking cracks right there. And there's another one right there. My god. There's cracks all over the center of the disc of this one. I'm going to put this one in, in this case for sure. I'll just go ahead and show you guys. I guess just for a minute or so. Which, uh... DVDs are in here, guys. These are ones that... These are Disney DVDs that... Um, for whatever reason, I put them in here for protection. Game Plan, VCD, GeForce, uh, DVD, Disc 2. There's that Wally UK DVD. Uh, no, that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for Snow White and Seven Dwarfs. We'll get to that. That's a Chinese import. This is the Malaysian Disc 1 and Disc 2 of National Treasure VCD. There's a couple others in here. I guess that's it. But yeah, guys. The center of the disc on this one's in bad shape. I'm gonna go ahead and put this one in, in that in that case. Let's do that. So um it's no longer so it doesn't that doesn't happen anymore. So I can still play it. Here's this two. This too, it looks fine, I guess. We got the Australian DVD of Expector Gadget 2. Thumb sucks, but I got it for collection purposes. Bonus DVD offer. 1,000 loyalty points. Offer expires 31st of August, 2006. <laughs> Mama, what are the cats up to? Oh dear, Mom's having fun with the kitties. Here's the spine. <laughs> I love our cats. Here's the back. Here's the disc. Bugs Life, this is the German version. Both discs are identical, have artwork wise. The German two disc DVD of Ratatouille. Disc one, disc two. We got the Jungle Book 40th Anniversary Edition. This is the Platinum Edition imported from the UK. Great Britain. Disc 1, Disc 2. Here's the Turkish DVD of Up. Ripped off the UK artwork on the disc. Chinese bootleg 2001 Platinum Edition DVD of Snowy and Some Dwarves. That is recycled, I believe, from Sleepy Hollow right there. Okay. That stuff's recycled from Sleepy Hollow. Okay, got it. Got uh, two more before we get to the VCDs. Well, one of them's a five disc set, so technically six DVDs. Chronicles of Narnia, Prince Caspian. This is actually imported from Greece. This is the Greek DVD. And also advertises um, High School Musical 3. It says soon to rent DVD High School Musical 3. And that movie looks like garbage. Oh, and guys, it looks like it came with an extra um, DVD case, just in case I need one. That's kind of nice. And they recycled the UK artwork, I guess. It's kind of odd. Did that, did that again. 
Probably because it's a country next to Turkey. That's probably why. Greece is the country next to Turkey, so I'd probably do that same thing. And here's the five movie collection of Pirates of the Caribbean 1 through 5. Spine. Here's the back. And, spoiler alert, I believe all five of them have boring gray discs. I don't feel like showing them all right now. I've shown them before in my previous uploads. Alright, now let's get to the VCDs. We got Mars Needs Mom's Turkish VCD. Yep, you guys finally are seeing what the Turkish uh, holograms look like. Yep. That's how the, the Turkish holograms are. It's pretty nice. I love their holograms they use over there. There's the spine. Obviously, that is in the Middle East. This is it, this was made in the Middle East. Here's the back. Back's upside down. It's in reverse. Pardon that. That's the ventilation. It's basically those ventilators right there. Disc one. Disc two. G Force. This is the Turkish VCD. Believe it or not, this still used the Waltz Entertainment logo at the beginning, which is crazy rare. Disc one. It looks like disc two is in there as well. Probably. Turkish VCD of Race to Witch Mountain. Same thing with this one. This has the Walt Disney Entertainment logo at the beginning as well, which is still, which is weird. I, I, I guess Turkey used it for an extended period of time. They used it till like 2009 or 2010. This two. Oops. Ah, uh, damn it. I accidentally broke the case. I didn't mean to do that. Just like G-Force. You know, G-Force was originally like that. Holy Holy moly, guys, I just noticed something. Look at all these ratings on this one. There's like three ratings. Two or three. Yeah, case isn't all in the best of condition, as you can see. It's pretty screwed up in some areas. We got the game plan with Dwayne DeWalk Johnson. Yeah, some of these aren't in the best of condition. Oh yeah, this one isn't either. Ratatouille Turkish VCD Yep, yeah, there's an even better look at Turkish hologram And please tell me in the description guys what you guys think of, of the Turkish hologram how it looks it Says 2006 on there go. This also has the Wall Street Entertainment at the beginning, just like the game plan. These also have, these all, these two also have the Wall Street Entertainment logos at the beginning. Disc 1 and Disc 2. Turkish VCD Ratatouille. National Treasure. This is the Malaysian version. This is imported from Malaysia. And obviously, both of the discs are in that case. I already showed them. Same with the game plan, by the way. Here's the Turkish version of National Treasure. This the, yeah, I have the Turkish one as well. It still says 2006 on there, on that hologram. Yeah, that's the Middle Eastern Turkish hologram. Disc two, disc one. Okay, we got three more. One's factory sealed, and that one I'm not gonna unseal. Because I wanna keep it sealed because it's rare. 
your backup. <coughs> sorry. <coughs> yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, what I was trying to say is that um, I'm gonna keep the one that's factory sealed just the way it is because it's it's way rarer when it's sealed. It's kind of like what you would see on the store shelf over there. <laughs> so I thought that'd be neat to keep it like that. Here is Aladdin. This is the Turkish Platinum Edition VCD. Look at this. Pretty interesting. And look at they added they added an extra A to it. And in on the Turkish edition. Cracked right there, but the disc still works. That's all that I care about. As long as the disc still works, I got no problem. And I like how they really stayed true to the original uh American copy artwork. Disc one. Ugh, I might have to put this one in that case to avoid it getting all scratched up. <sighs> I think it's about time to put these in that other case, too. This case is wearing out. This two. Look at that. It reminds me of the, of the American copy, kind of. How they the artworks are the same, pretty much. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and add this one there, too. I think it needs it. And it needs to be added in here in my blue book. I might try to get some more of these books, um, DVD books, so I can put more DVDs in there. Yeah, obviously, obviously that those that one in National Treasure do have the Wall Street Entertainment logos at the beginning. Those are pretty obvious. Two more. We got John Carter. My only copy of this movie. I might get a couple other copies for the back for the collection purposes. And here's the spine. So far, the only one I have is the Turkish one. Fine. Here is the back. Here's another Turkish hologram. Here's a later one from 2012. Yep, there's a later hologram from 2012 from Turkey. It's pretty nice. Disc one. Disc two. All right, lastly. Christmas Carol. This one's factory sealed. I'm going to keep it that way. It's fine. Here is the back. Still say Town 6 on here. Oh, no. It says Town 7. Huh. Yeah. Really cool. Hope you guys enjoyed my Disney DVD and VCD collection, regions 2 through 5. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Thank you guys for watching. This is the longest video I've ever recorded on this phone. Hopefully, it'll probably take a while to upload, but I it'll be worth it later, guys, for, for you guys. Because it's it's really fun to watch, and you guys can actually see it in HD quality. So I figured why not try attempt to do it this way for a change. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.